today, Britain's top real role model is with Judge Patrick Grant, director of Norton and Sons. From doing some research about you, it didn't seem that fashion was necessarily the obvious route for you to take. So what was that moment where you thought, actually, that's a career for me? Well, it wasn't really, um, it wasn't really a thought decision. I came across by accident um, an advert in the newspaper and you know it was about this big and it just said for sale tailors Savile Row that was pretty much it facts I fell in love with it pretty quickly and and it uh, it went from there to where I am now and that's really it I mean that's how any I think how any business in the fashion world that's successful grows is by having a, a unique point of view that usually you find is the point of view of one individual. Sometimes it's a couple of people, but most of the time it's one. Even the more mainstream ones like Ralph Lauren and Giorgio Armani and Calvin Klein, I mean, these are all individual guys who just picked up and started a brand. I mean, Mucha Prada is one that I kind of admire because she's continually refreshing her business. So it looks like everything's been going really well for you, but have there been any major mistakes along the way? I mean, I don't think there have been any mistakes that are you know, so so enormous they've had a material difference. But of course we make mistakes. You have to, you know, things will go wrong. Not necessarily things of your own making. You have to be unbelievably resilient. You know, every problem that comes along, you have to resolve. And you have to resolve them immediately. And I think that's something that most good entrepreneurs understand. I gave up you know, a well-paid job that I knew I was good at and sold everything that I had and remortgaged my other house, sold one house, remortgaged the other one and kind of went all in, um, which I guess was a risk. You know, you have to be utterly driven. I mean, you really need to want to stay at work for 100 hours a week or more. and deal with every awful thing that comes along as well as all the fun stuff. I think successful business people have a sort of force of personality. I think you need to have a clarity of idea. So I think too many businesses are, are, are unfocused. And I think the very best businesses do one thing and do one thing extremely well. You know, unless you do things, things won't happen to you. And I think the more interesting things come your way, the more opportunities they will lead you to. Are you Britain's top real role model? 